do you think you're talking to? First woman commissioner in the history of New York, thank you, worked my way up from the bottom, even helped draft that family court act. You are talking, mister, to a woman who knows the law. I don't give a damn what the law says. I'm all over war bucks and as far as I can say. pardon me. You, I knew just what your response would be. Since you think you're better than her or me. Oh, God, how you people stick in my craw. Well, sir, you're not above the law. You probably even jaywalk. You're not equal to folks like Doyle or Clark. So you walk on the grass and double park. Think your dough can open up any door. Well, sir, you're not above the law. So let the record show that all your fancy loot, that all your booty and your lawyer so snooty will not deter me from my duty. So I think that I'll call the New York Times. Plus those tabloids that gobble up such crimes. Ten-inch headlines Wall Street will not ignore. Warbucks thinks he's above the law. Miss Clark. I can't believe this. Do something. Be reasonable, Commissioner. Granted that Mr. Warbucks is not married, think of the happiness he can give her. <laughs> a child doesn't need happiness. She needs hygiene. What? And a woman to train her in it. In other words, along with a father, a child needs a mother. I don't need a mother. Oh, yes, you do. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, yes, you do. Oh, no, she doesn't. I'll be leaving. I see that you won't budge. We'll just put this matter before some judge. You, like all your kind, have one bit of flaw. You all think you're above it. Tell the system to shove it. Well, go do it. I love it. Sir, you are not above the law.